As part of our broader business observability strategy, we've extended our monitoring into application security. This enables our customers to detect real-time security threats and provides a way to mitigate them before they're being exploited. Today, I'll give you a sneak peek into how we're able to accomplish that. Let's get into the demo. I'm starting here in the App Dynamics controller at our application dashboard, our control center for monitoring everything within our application, 80 Financial. This is our application flow map, an automatically discovered real-time visualization of all the components that make up our application. Secure application is embedded directly into those lightweight agents that were used to build out this view. This means we're already deployed throughout our customers' environments and living in the application runtime. Now notice on the right here, we have a new security events tab where we've identified six critical security issues. Let's take a deeper look. When we drill into the events tab, we're presented with the secure application UI, which lists all the vulnerabilities impacting our application. Traditionally, security teams scan in a pre-prod environment and send their findings to the app ops teams with little to no context on where it needs to be fixed. With the analysis we're providing, not only do app ops and SecOps team have access to real-time production vulnerability scanning, we're using the data from App Dynamics to map this to the affected applications and services. This enables the team to do two things. One, quickly triage without having to sift through multiple systems or logs, and two, prioritize the criticality of the fix based on where it's detected. Now notice that one of these vulnerabilities looks a little bit different from the others. This tells us that we're seeing this actively exploited within our own application. When it comes to security breaches, time is of the essence, so let's see how quickly we can work to remediate this. As I drill in further, I can begin to understand how this vulnerability weakens my application. This specific vulnerability allows rogue actors to execute arbitrary commands remotely, and it potentially grants them access to the data on our system. Right away, we can understand when this was first detected and what are those remediation steps required to fix it. So now that we understand what this vulnerability is, what applications and instances are being targeted, let's take a deeper look into how it's being actively exploited. Our first focus is answering a couple different questions about the attack. Was there any sensitive data that was accessed? Was any malicious code executed on our system? Finding the answer to these questions can typically take months and sometimes the full scope and the brevity of the attack is never identified. In this view, we can help easily answer some of those questions. On the left here, we're providing some context about the attack and the methodology that was used to detect it. And the bottom right here is one of the most powerful views on the screen. We're able to analyze how the attack was executed and provide a full stack trace of that attack down to the line of code. This way, an app team knows exactly where they need to go to remove the exploit. We're also able to surface the exact commands that were executed, which helps us understand if this was just an initial rookie attack, or is there something more sinister happening where sensitive data was removed from the server. We've condensed all of this information into one easily consumable view, which saves countless hours of analysis. So now that we have this information we need, let's stop the attack from happening again before anything nefarious happens. This brings us to our policy configuration. And when I take a look at the policy that detects this, this attack, I can change our response from detect to block. And in almost real time, that new policy is pushed to our app environment with no need for redeployment or agent restarts. This means no downtime and no visible impact on the business. Now we have the confidence that we're protected against the attack and our app team can carefully work to update the code and affect it library. So now back on this vulnerability view, let's see what changed. Since we live in the application, once that updated library has been pushed out to production, we can see in real time, this vulnerability has been fixed. So let's recap here. Within a few clicks, we've gone from detecting an attack, determining the scope and severity, 
blocking it from happening again, and providing a remediation step so our customers can fix it. The average business spends months and countless hours to perform this sort of analysis. We just did it in the amount of time it takes to make a cup of coffee.